actress. She starred in I Know What You Did Last Summer and Scream Due. Also stars in the popular series Buffy the Vampire Slayer, which airs Tuesday nights on the WB. Please welcome Sarah Michelle Geller. <laughs> Okay. Now, you've lived here a few years now, and a couple of times you've been here, we've always talked about earthquakes, but you've never been through an earthquake. Now, we had one recently. Did you, were you here? Were you here I for I was. I had my first earthquake experience, and it wasn't quite what I expected. Yeah, yeah. I, uh, I had gotten home from work really, really late, and uh, I have a roommate for the first time, my, my best friend from high school. Right. And uh, it was Friday night when we had the earthquake, and she never knows if I've actually gone out after work or if I'm still working, and so right, right. she was way asleep before I came home, and I sort of crawled into bed. And around 2 a.m., I sort of felt this, it was like a rolling motion. It right, wasn't like right. shaky like I expected. And I went, oh my God. So the first thing I do is check both dogs. And then I scream, Barrett. And she yells out, Sarah, what are you doing in there? <laughs> and, I'm, uh, and I yell back at her, you know, hey, it's an earthquake, right? And she said, oh my God, I thought you had someone in there. And then I'm thinking, well. <laughs> If I could make the whole house shake, I wouldn't be single. Right. But, uh, <laughs> but, <laughs> and then, but the best part is, so, you know, I do like what you're supposed to. I get the animals. I'm, like, standing in the doorway. Are you supposed to get the animals and stand in the doorway? Well, I couldn't leave my animals. I mean, the animals know what to do instinctively. They just, like, run off or something. <laughs> and then I go back to her room. She's out cold again. Yeah. She's just sleeping. Now, what did you do? Were you in the doorway? So I didn't quite make it to the door. It was kind of over before I actually got out of bed. Now, and do you get out of bed, get dressed, then go to the doorway, or just go to the doorway? I just went to the doorway. Just went to My the neighbors doorway. are lovely, you know? It's yeah. <laughs> You'll have guys outside shaking your house tomorrow. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> now, how are the dogs? You didn't do the, you didn't dress them up for Halloween, did you? You, wanna, you know, this is one of my pet peeves, people who like, uh, you ever see these people who like um, dye their dogs a different color, that kind of thing? You have a problem with people that, that put color You've in You've done that? Dogs? Did you do that? Um, last year I did. I used that, like, temporary hair oh, mascara. Come on. One. But this year I went as Dorothy for part of the day, and he just made a little good as, Toto. Oh, it's Dorothy uh, from Toto. The Wizard of Oz? Yes. Oh, okay. Was that your first choice? I had a lot of Halloween costumes yeah, this yeah. year. See, uh, I, uh, I was Little Red Riding Hood on the show. Mm -hmm. And uh, so for Halloween I was going to be Little Red Riding Whore and rework little the red costume. Little Red Riding Whore. And I was going to rework <laughs> I think I have that video. <laughs> <laughs> Little Red Riding Hole. I don't even know how that would. I, I guess it's. I was going to sort of rework the costume a little. Yeah, and then the at story. the last second, we decided, <laughs> we decided to go to the Playboy Mansion. Oh, oh you went up to heaven? I did, yeah. Do you have to bring girls to the Playboy Mansion? That seems Well, it's really interesting. I said, how many people can I bring? Yeah. And they said, well, if it's girls, you can bring as many as you want. Wow. If it's guys, you can bring one. That's what we were told. Oh, you only allow one guy. One guy. Did he have to be over 50? Is it one of those girls? <laughs> no, we were Did, like, all... James Franciscus hit on you or something? <laughs> one of those girls? We, we were all girls, and we went. <laughs> so, and, uh, but I wimped out the last second, because I thought, oh, I'll feel so, like, inadequate next to all these bunnies with the, the boobs and the no, height and the no. hair and stuff. So I, I sort of, I went as a, like, kind of as a rock star. I put these red extensions in my hair, and I wore, like, these leather pants, and I wore these, these dog collars, these diamond-studded right, dog right. collars and wrist collars. And all I got all night is, yeah, what's she dressed as? Buffy the Vampire Slayer? What's she, Sarah Michelle Gellar? All I heard all night. Oh, that's funny. And I'm thinking, do they think that's what I go out like with dog collars and leather? And, I mean, people have a really strange view of me, apparently. Now, were there people walking? Were there, like, naked people? See, okay, I, see you, this, this is, this is I, a I'm always working. I'm so I don't glad, get to go to this. I'm so glad that you asked me this. So, <laughs> yeah. there's a couple things in this industry that you get to do that are really special. Right. And one of the things I always wanted to do was see the Playboy Mansion. Right, and right. I've heard about it since the day that I was born. Right. So you have this idea of just total debauchery. Just yeah, like that's what people I having sex and corners and naked bodies. And, and so we're in the car, and it was four girls, and we're in the car talking about it because we, we had a driver because right. we wanted to not have to basically park. And uh, <laughs> we're lazy. And uh, we're talking about, and there'll be like naked people and swinging from the chandeliers. And our driver turns around to us and said, Is this honestly what you girls think goes on there? And uh, he's like, where are you? He said, is this your first time there? And I said, well, yeah. And he said, well, it's not mine. And he proceeded to explain to us that it's a perfectly regular house with just yeah. some really beautiful people. And he totally made us feel horrible for all of our, our fantasy visions oh, there. Well, now you're ruining it for me. I'm sorry. Oh. There, there was one naked person. There was a naked person. Man or a woman? It was a woman. Oh. And she was, uh, she was totally naked, and she had her body spray-painted as a leopard. And I thought, well, if she could do that, I should have just worn the Little Red Riding Whore outfit. Yeah, but... that's right. 
Now, I know Buffy goes to college, and you're also doing Angel, right? I, next week is, uh, is my first crossover. I go and, uh, thank you. Uh, <laughs> I go over to the other show, and I, I visit Angel. Everyone has to watch. I'm okay. And your crossover, I like that. Crossover. You know, I have something for you. Uh-oh. Because, you know, each year, you, you always talk about how Christmas, and it's always, remember I always bring you snow? He brought me snow. I bring you snow. Ooh. Look, I have snow. I, well, it's a little, you, know, you want to throw it at somebody? I just want to know where you find snow in Burbank. We went to Lake Arrowhead. Oh. This is Lake Arrowhead. So we had a guy drive up there, an idiot intern who gets no money. <laughs> is there anybody you want to throw in it? Uh -oh. Very good, Sarah Michelle Geller. Now I know. Uh -oh. Sarah, I know you got to go. I know I you have to go I know back you, to I know you're filming. They sort of spring me for like an hour to well, come Well, thanks. Thanks for coming over and helping us. Thanks a lot. My Sarah pleasure. Michelle Thank Geller. You. Be right back. We should go right after.